In this video, I'll show you how to complete the exercise 1.2 in Excel online called Learn to Find and Replace Data. So sign into Jasper Active by going to Rapid Identity, Office 365, click on Excel, and choose a new blank workbook. Go to the three dots and open up Jasper Active for Excel. Click on Lessons, and we're still working on the first lesson or chapter called Manage Worksheets and Workbooks. Click Start. And this is the second exercise called Learn to Find and Replace Data. So click on Learn to Find and Replace Data. In this exercise, you will learn how to enter text and values in a worksheet. Click Start. This one only has three steps to it, three parts. So on the Home tab, we're going to find the tool called Find and Select. Go up to the ribbon. The Find and Select tool looks just like a magnifying glass like it did in Word. All right, we're going to click on the Find and Select button and choose Find. And we're going to search for the word United. So let's type in United and click Find Next. So it takes us down to row 193 and click Find Next a few more times and you will see the other occurrences. There are three. Click Submit on part one. All right, part two, now that you have seen how a simple search works, let's try making some changes to narrow the search. So in the Find and Replace dialog box, we're gonna click on Search Options. Click on Search Options. We're gonna click the button that says Match Case. Okay, this means uppercase or lowercase. So we're gonna click Find Next. And this time it will say it cannot find the data because there is no occurrence of the word United. It's all lowercase. So now in the Find What box, change that to a capital U for United and click Find Next. And this time it does work. Click Find Next a couple more times because we have told it to find exactly the same type of case. So it starts with the uppercase. All right, in the find what box, let's change it to Spain, all lowercase. And we're gonna turn off the match case button. And let's click find next several times. So there are two parts, or two sections that have the word Spain, row 171 and row 186. All right, now we're going to click the button that says match entire cell contents. So let's click the button that says match entire cell contents. Click find next. And now it is only find that finding that first occurrence because it matches exactly the contents. The other one didn't pop up because it had extra words. All right, on question number two, we're done. Click submit. And now we're on the last task. In the find what box, we're gonna type X. And we're going to click Find Next. Let's turn off the Match Entire Cell Contents box. Turn that off. Find Next. There are lots of words that contain the letter X. All right, now we're going to click the Replace button. So now in the Replace, we have a Find What box and a Replace With box. In the replace with box, we're going to change, we're going to type ZH, ZH, and let's click find next. So it found the first word, it found Luxembourg, and we're going to click the option to replace. And so now instead of an X, it has the ZH. So now let's click the replace all button. So it will do that for every word with an X. And it should say, all done, we made three replacements. Now we're going to click this X to close the task pane. And we are done. Click Submit and Finish. And you've now completed Excel Exercise 1.2. Click Finish and back to my lesson.